Games like GTA, whether it's the fast cars or the loaded guns you love, here's everything you need to check out. Happily, there are some fantastic action games out there capture similar crime-ridden missions and car-related escapades. With some of the best open-world games to explore, there are no shortage of options out there. So, watch this video until end and we take you through the 5 best games like GTA you can get stuck into right now, while waiting for Grand Theft Auto 6. Number 1. Red Dead Redemption 2. You can probably guess why this one is here. Both the GTA series and Red Dead are made by the same studio, after all. Despite the early 20th century setting, Red Dead Redemption 2 and its predecessor, if you feel like taking a step back in time exemplify GTA's values of player freedom in an expansive open world that feels alive. A commitment to including even the most minute details and morally questionable men and women doing morally questionable things. It would be oversimplifying the experience to call Red Dead Redemption to Grand Theft Auto with horses, but it's well worth checking out if you're in a GTA sort of mood. Number 2. Just Cause 4. Just cause for delights in unprecedented levels of chaos, and it accomplishes this by giving you, the player, a ridiculous amount of freedom. Wingsuit, check. Grappling hook, check. The ability to surf on cars as a massive tornado lifts them into the air, double check. If you were amused by the ragdoll physics of GTA 5, just wait till you see what you can achieve in the Republic of Medici. To be clear, just Cause 4 holds none of the storytelling class or mechanical polish of Rockstar's signature franchise, but it instead excels with its literally sky-high approach to choreographing carnage on a massive scale. Number 3. Watch Dogs 2 The original Watch Dogs was such a sour-hearted affair that a Den Perse's tale of revenge becomes almost unbearable by the end of it, but Ubisoft took that criticism to heart for the sequel. As such, the studio's follow-up is choose much more closely to the sentiments and tone of contemporary Grand Theft Auto titles by using its setting as the stage for biting satire. Remember the Life Invader mission from Grand Theft Auto V? Watch Dogs 2 is essentially that, but blown up to the scale of an entire game. Rockstar's parody of Silicon Valley still packs a little more punch than Ubisoft's, but Watch Dogs to regardless holds plenty of laughs for anyone who's had to sit through an Apple conference or a Facebook commercial. And hey, you get to use pool balls attached to bungee cord as a weapon. That's pretty sweet. Number 4. Mafia Definitive Edition Remade from the ground up, rise through the ranks of the Mafia during the Prohibition era. After an inadvertent brush with the mob, Tommy Angelo is reluctantly thrust into the world of organized crime. There is yet to exist a Grand Theft Auto game which doesn't include a run-in with the Mafia in some measure, which naturally leaves Decay's Mafia series as a good starting point for open-world enthusiasts with a taste for organized crime. These games come across as more grounded than the GTA series and its ilk, but you can easily see the echoes of titles like San Andreas and Grand Theft Auto for shining through their design. Number 5. Saints Row. Okay, so this may be a bit of a controversial suggestion, but hear us out on this one. We used to suggest that you go play Saints Row, the third is a convincing alternative to GTA 5, but given that it is now over a decade old, perhaps it's time for us to suggest something new. Volition released a Saints Row reboot in 2022, and it has proven to be a little divisive. In our Saints Row review we noted that Volition has released a fun, but frustrating update to the franchise that has moments of inspiration and irritation, and that the reboot kickstarts a new era that's still somewhat stuck in the past, so maybe the new Saints Row isn't the GTA 5 contender we hoped it would be. But that doesn't mean there isn't fun to be had here. And besides, after nine years spent exploring Los Santos, perhaps a new location to host some open-world carnage is long overdue. That's all for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more. Thanks for watching.